turtle. We're back. I can't believe you picked against me again. <sighs> I'm sorry. Every time, <laughs> every time we pick against each other, in the middle of the series, I swear we're like, can we change uh, yeah, picks? No. <laughs> one of us, one of us is always, it's always asking. Me. It's know? always Well, actually, sometimes I try. I to think ask usually it's me. You, it, it's it's a back and forth, but especially with with what is that top two contender game. Game right now, excuse me. It's okay. It, I'm getting choked up over here. It's all that coffee in the. Mouth. I know it really is. <laughs> but uh, you know it's okay. We're gonna get yeah. started in these games. And right out of the gate, we're already in. So, off kickoff, Godsmilla attacking the corner, relating wave there to assist Noli backward pass attempt, but no one there from Flamersant. Noli attempting to pass that in. Challenge from Tho. Virtuoso just taking his time. You see him, you saw him calling off relating wave there as well. Yeah. Noli dodging that demo. Trying to get that boost and get out of dodge. Pass over to Godsmilla. That one off the crossbar again up high. Nachito will send that out. Now center oh, ball for Noli. Noli blocked out by relating wave. And now the clear from Nachito. And James, I agree with you. I think both these teams, you know, there's not one player who we're, we're kind of waiting to make mistakes. All three of them can pop off and show, you know, their abilities at any second. But the pressure from Flaunt Razan has been overwhelming. Now, yeah. Relating Wave attempting to clear it. A hit up by Noli over to Godsmilla. Godsmilla will hit this down. So we'll see if Discombobulators can break out of their half. Yeah. Finally starting to get some momentum. Good speed from Godsmilla. We'll get it up to Tho. Tho aiming for the backboard in a scary moment for Nachito. As he leaves that for Virtuoso to get the clear. Good stop from Nachito. He'll stay on this ball. A challenge with Tho incoming. Gets it by one. Godsmilla turns. The challenge is back to Tho. Tho popping it up. Going for the shot. And he gets it by the Discombobulator's defense. And Tho cleaning up again. Look at this 50 right now. What a challenge from Godsmilla. Laying it perfectly for Tho. He's got an easy flick. So much time. And again, Tho the clutch maker to finish out a lot of these shots. And, you know, it's just another situation where that Dominus being flat allowed him to get enough height yeah. on that ball. I mean, I don't get even know. Follow -up do you shot. think he would have gotten that with the Octane? It's tough to say. I mean, I, I don't use the Octane. I use the Merc. <laughs> but it is the same hitbox, so I I don't know. Because I feel like a bigger car, it's not going to pop up as high. Yeah. He's not going to be able to get the height on the shot. It's an easier challenge. It's a bold move using the Merc, James. I'm proud of it. Now a miss hit down, but though, stay with it. Relating wave. Pops it up, though, in the air. Is going to center it to a teammate. Double commit from Discombobulators. Nachito down to the corner. Noli, good control in yeah. the corner. And then, then that chance over to Godsmilla. Noli making a play right there. It's good patience. Uh, you know, in the rival series, I feel like it's it's really easy to give into that kickball mentality and just try and clear it as much as you can. You know, you got a lot of st time and space on the field. How are you going to make use of it? But what a demo from Discombobulators. And Virtuoso, he misses the ball, gets the demo, then he missed the boost. So Virtuoso... A little bit of a struggle moment for him. Yeah. Center ball down to Tho. Tho blocked by Virtuoso. Pinch pass into the middle attempted. Virtuoso also gets the boost steal. Just trying to get in the way, and he is. Center up ball. Godsmilla's there. Relating wave. Got back to the net in time. He was waiting for that. Clear to the side. Flaunt Mersant. Has been so good at preventing the Discombobulator's counterattack, yeah. keeping them locked into their half. And I think a big factor of that is Noli, the touches and placements he's getting for just controlling the ball, having a, a calm defensive state of mind is perfect. Yeah, we saw him make that pass into the middle to Godsmilla when he controlled it in the corner. Yeah. Certainly looking sharp. Again, Godsmilla there for Flaunt Razant. Ball floating out into the middle. Noli pops it up for Tho. Tho off the ceiling and down. It goes backwards. It pinches off of him. Chance for Discombobulators. Godsmilla sends it to the corner. Noli there gets full boost. But Nachito with the challenge. Bouncing out to the middle. A big clear from Godsmilla. Follow. And now a demo. The shot towards net. Saved by Relating Wave. 
Croissant has continued to batter the net, and they finally break through two to nothing with under a minute left. I mean, after the demo, the constant pressure, Croissant just what rotations to come through. Noli, easy finish off. He's the third man rotating in, and so far the pressure has been overwhelming right now for Discombobulators. It certainly has been. So many opportunities for Croissant. Yeah. Now we're relating wave up. Godsmilla gets to it first. Another pop up. Godsmilla on the backboard. Clearing it off the ceiling. Gets another touch and Tho bails him out. Nachito up to Virtuoso. Noli off the backboard to Tho. Tho just missing his shot. Follow up from Godsmilla. That one deflected off the defender and went in. Whether he meant to fake it or not, Tho didn't get the hit. I mean, you're discombobulated. you got to go for a stop. Godsmiller with an easy follow-up. They just assumed he was going to hit it. And they're running away with this game. I mean, this is over. Flomp has put their foot down. Yeah. Game one. James, would you like to change your pick? Yeah. From what I saw last week, it's very likely that Discombobulators will win game two. Yeah. Very oh heavily. Look at that. And what on earth? Oh, my goodness. Even if you remember the two Discombobulator uh, games that we saw as Flom Rison gets the win, they always had a slow start yeah, in game one. So that just might be their MO. But Flom Rison looked very good comparatively. You can see there, nine shots to just two. Yeah. I mean, we barely saw any pressure from Discombobulators. No, no midfield passing. All the clears were pretty stagnant. And Flomp were doing a great job of rotating in and having somebody come in as that third man for the finishing shot every single time there was a punishing opportunity. Yeah, great challenges as well. Yeah. We even saw that 50-50 that led to that one goal by Tho where he comes in and pops up the ball, goes yeah. for the shot, gets it over the defender. And then you also called it out. Noli just looking confident. Definitely. Getting the control plays, getting the passes out, and, and all around. Flomp looking much yeah. better than Discombobulator. Everybody getting involved. In, and like Noli, it wasn't just you know being calm. It was the little touches. Even when he's running back on defense, he managed to get the tiny little touch to keep possession and get a better 50. So the, all in all, the defense was superb, and they just never had a lot of pressure or force on them because their clears were too, gro or too good. Yeah, me. so Discombobulators have a lot to figure out. Yeah. Getting shut out this game, not really even having an opportunity to score. There was a, a missed touch that I remember off the ceiling in front yeah. of the net, but Tho was just so fast, he got up there and cleared the ball out anyway. Definitely. So not even really any serious scoring opportunities for discombobulators. They're going to have to go back to the drawing board for game two. Yeah. And we, we saw pretty much no passes come out from them. There was no possession game for them. It was really more or less, how can I just get this ball and alleviate the pressure? They weren't looking for the next step. And we also saw just some some misses. Virtuoso, he missed the hit. Yeah. He missed the boost. He still got the demo on that play. But Discombobulator is not as sharp as we've seen them before. Yeah. See if anything changes in game two. So off the wall. Godsmilla getting challenged by a zero boost relating wave out into the middle. A demo from Godsmilla. Nachito. Little greedy. Wanted to get the boost and the ball. Ended up only getting boost on that play. And Tho trying to hit that mid-air pass. And then, oh, he tries to save it on the flip back. Just a hair's width away from the save. It was a good idea, just not communicated well. Noli going for it. And it that was the little touches on the defensive end that I thought they were doing great with. But when you're not communicating it, that's when it can be a problem. So getting shut out in game one. And Having were, that struggle, then they yeah. come out hot. I mean, you were right, James. Discombobulators, let's, let's see if they can pick it up. Could have been uh, just a little warm-up game to uh, Discombobulators roster that is going to start you know, picking things up and connecting passes. We will see, and only time will tell. As that play from Noli gets blocked. Virtuoso flipping it by Godsmilla. Zero boost. Going for the challenge. It kicks it across. Good play from Virtuoso. You can see relating wave. Dumping that ball into the corner, Virtuoso has to turn for it. Still on zero boost, finally getting the corner boost. All boosted up, ready to make the play. Virtuoso upfield. Hits it by, it's going to bounce out to Relating Wave. Nachito racing to it. He's going to bail out. Does turn and get the stop. Noli full boost. Going for a big clear, Relating Wave stops it. Going for a second touch. Gets oh. the dunk down, it's going to bounce out. 
into the corner. Low boost for Godzilla. Noli's the last hope. Godzilla dodging a bump there. This one bouncing off the backboard has to go Apollo. off the ceiling. That was his only option. He was so low on boost. Going for the height. Godzilla heads up play on defense. Yeah. To get that clear. And the pressure is on right now for Discombobulator. It's a huge difference from the first game. Starting to look for each other with clears, passing, and their, their corner play has been on par with what I've seen throughout the, the entire season so far for them. And that one's off a challenge, just rolling in, Turtle. Break it down. I don't know how we got the way you expect me to break down this 50 right now. I mean, he just challenged it at the perfect angle. And I, you got to feel right now, if you're Flom, that's a frustrating challenge to lose. But at the same time, you just have to be aware where the net is. Yeah. And off kickoff, Virtuoso denies, though. And a center ball, Noli. A split second away from making that connection. So Flaunt Resant, they're having some chances. Definitely. But still not able to connect. And that net seemed vulnerable. You even saw there, Virtuoso knew that a defender was going to get back, so he tried to just keep possession. Relating waves up. Hits it right to though, who puts it off oh, the backboard. Hit. Virtuoso has to make the Ooh. save, and he can! A perfectly placed shot from Noli. And talk about the pass from though. What a positioning to read the defensive clear, then Noli, the speed to get up there, and wow. you can't find you better can't placement that. than that. You can't block that. You, he saw Virtuoso on, on the near side of the net. He goes far post top corner. Yeah. You can't stop that. And Tho was in the position immediately waiting the response. Great play from him. So really enjoyed what I've seen so far from Flomp. Especially on the offensive side of the ball. However, Discombobulators still in the lead. Pass up field to Tho. Tho going for the double tap, but Nachito will cut it out. Godsmilla off the backboard. Virtuoso up. Passes over to Relating Wave. Who sends it downfield. Virtuoso can't get to the ball in time. And Tho clears it over to Godsmilla. Noli up off the ceiling. Godsmilla perhaps looking for a demo or a bump there. Ends up rotating out. Virtuoso high hit. Tho denies the backboard. More backboard attack. Godsmilla there. Oh, Another the demo. demo. Tho able to get there. And physical play coming out from Discombobulators as well. Just throwing off the defensive rotation right now of Flomp. You're noticing they can't get any pressure. That's just because they don't have the boost or the positioning from these demos. And the demos were a big factor last week in the RLCS, especially in North America. Yeah. Demos becoming such a key part of the game as another demo happens on Tho from Virtuoso. Virtuoso, last back, gonna have to make a good play and a big clear, that one off the ceiling, down to Godzilla. Who attempted to pass it, and now the ball leaking out to Tho. Tho, missing that shot. Instead, going for the pass, but no one was there in the middle. Tho, eight boost, enough to get a hit. Nachito clearing it off to the side. Noli first to it. Center ball. Oh, got Smilla. Got Smilla off the backboard. Throw the shot and that one off the post and in. Flop tie it up. Though again, the cleanup from this man has been amazing. God Smilla, he could have finished it right there, but he just hit it wide. And Though following through, he is so clutch for this Flop team. You said it. Game five, huge performance from him last week to close out the series and in game two late, another big play. Noli pushing this down and Discombobulators, the final oh. attack, they do it. Seven seconds on the clock, Relating Wave threads the needle. Just when I thought the momentum might have been switching, Relating Wave comes through with a great ceiling pass from Nachito. And they, they might run away with I mean, there's seven seconds left. They got to have a solid kickoff here from Flomp. Noli wins it back to Tho. But Tho is demoed. He trades. Nachito just trying to take his time. It does hit the, the wall. It will stay up. No boost for Virtuoso. Good touch. Kept in the air. Virtuoso hitting it to some free space and discombobulators. 
sneak away yeah. with a win. That was – I thought they were about to give that one away. I agree. I mean, if you look at the quality of shots, I thought that flomp really had a lot of creative hits, great passing, but then discombobulated. That third goal – was the best for them, you know, connecting a ceiling hit and then finally having a good follow-up at the end of the game. You know, they're back in the series for sure, and I think this is more of the discombobulators we're used to. Yeah, discombobulators, they came back. I mean, I've, this was just a one-goal game, and yeah. you think back to that challenge goal uh, where I think I believe it was Tho uh, who ch- who challenged the, the player in discombobulators. The ball just leaks into the yeah. net. That was the difference. And Flomp, to me, is looking offensively like the better team. I agree. They, they have much more threatening opportunities. Yeah. They've narrowly missed out on a couple chances. And even at the end, stepping up to even tie it up in those final seconds. Yeah. However, Discombobulators, they continue to find ways to win. And uh, if they play like this, the series, they can, they can get back in their favor. Yeah. However... Flomp still looks solid. Yeah, offense. I mean, they're going to be scary if they can just seal up those little mistakes. Like you said, it just came down to a little bit of a challenge, a, a good demo, good uh, physical play from Discombobulators. But overall, I thought the mechanics were better from Flomp. But it comes down to if you're not going to make that hit, that clear from the defensive end, then there's no way, no matter how great your offense is, to win the series. Yeah, defense, such a critical part of yeah. the game. But still, uh, Discombobulators in Game 1, they were kept in their own half yeah. almost the entirety of of the game. They broke and, out. Yeah, and they broke out this game. So it's a it's a different series so far, but what we saw from Flomp last week was a lot of back and forth. We'll see if that same theme plays out here today. Though so, over to the corner. Virtuoso battling. Nachito goes for the backward pass, also gets in Tho's way. Relating wave with the demo. A big pop-up into the middle. Virtuoso space. off the backboard. And a clear out. Discombobulators on the attack. Relating wave. That one denied by Noli. Still looked like it might have been just a touch high. But the pressure from Discombobulators insane right now. The demo. The center. Relating wave. No one back. And Discombobulators overwhelm Flomp Rison. Get the goal. I mean, that was just 38 seconds of sheer pressure and resilience from Discombobulators constantly rotating in, beating out every single challenge. And for the the, the part of the, the first part of this game, it was literally just only them touching the ball. And that has to be frustrating. Yeah. I know when I'm playing and there's a team that is just in my half and doesn't <laughs> let up and they're demoing me, I get a little upset. And even, they even were having solid defense from Flop. They managed to get a few saves in, but it just wasn't enough. Off the ceiling, Virtuoso getting a slight hit. That one being challenged off a defender. Godsmilla will get full boost, gets it by one. We'll see if he can get by another. Going for the pass. No, he's going for the shot. You saw the demo play. Two committed. Numbers advantage briefly. As that chip shot is turned aside by Noli. And you see there a bump, a demo play actually backfiring a little bit. Yeah. It connect. So those plays aren't without risk. There's a lot of midfield space right now for, for Discombobulators. I feel like all of Flomp are really deep in their defensive end. And it's just giving them spot, time and space to run away with it. And the demo comes through. Nachito, he's going to finish it off. This is, the, is this the Pittsburgh Knights? What's going on? You see there the pass down attempt virtuoso <laughs> with the demo. And Tho was actually smoke screen. He was right behind yeah. that demo. He couldn't see where the ball was coming from. And also he had just jumped off backwards. So who knows how much boost he even had. Physical play, huge factor right now for Discombobulators. And they're the only team right now doing it, Flump. Sometimes you just got to fight fire with fire. You see Virtuoso having full faith in Nachito to get that ball. Didn't even jump for it. Discombobulators looking in form. Nachito taking his time, pops it high. He'll stay with it. Hard. Hit off the corner was actually towards net. Relating wave. The challenge, another demo, center ball. No, it's a shot off the backboard. And now clear downfield to Godsmilla. Godsmilla. And now Noli taking over. How many demos are on the screen right now? <laughs> it was, everyone was gone <laughs> except for Noli right there. I think he might have been the only yeah. car on the field. And it was two demos coming out from Discombobulators, and Noli's just like, what happened to my team right now? And yet, Discombobulators, they could not find any pressure or connection through it. 
Virtuoso. Though and Relating Wave both running into each other, so... Starting to get more aggressive yeah. on both sides. We that's, have to send in the ref. That's what I want to see right now from Flop. Respond to the aggression from Discombobulators. Ball back to the middle. Shot opportunity. It was a weak one back to Relating Wave. Center ball to Tho. Tho, the strong oh. shot. But it was just off and Relating Wave was able to get the clear. Noli touches it by Nachito, who's out of boost. He'll be out of the play for a little bit. Turns for this ball. And he'll get out, double commit, shot towards net, counterattack opportunity, but a big challenge there from, who was that? Nachito. Nachito, big play to slow down the counterattack. Yeah, and the hesitation, he, he no hesitation at all from Nachito, even with two players of his double committing, still getting the pressure in, great play from him. A flop have been shut down. Time is running out, yeah. we're approaching that final minute of gameplay, and it's all oh, discombobulators, God Smilla had to, Block that one off the arc. Good pass down to Noli, but again blocked out by Virtuoso. The vision's there for Flomp, but Discombobulator has the same vision. They're cutting these passes out. Yeah. Virtuoso, a double commit, and he's got no boost. Numbers advantage. Follow. Taking the wide shot. This oh. one off that elbow and out. Got Smilla. That had to be a goal. That was the chance yeah. for Flomp. And I love the patience from Tho as well to try and get around the ball, but he just got too you much to of it. You just have to finish those. We saw the double commit in the corner by Discombobulators. Another chance. And again, stopped out by Virtuoso. The first touch control on the back wall. Nachito getting in front of Noli. Goal back to Noli. Noli dropping it down. God Smilla getting a piece of it, but final 10 seconds. Time running out. And it's not going to be enough time. Discombobulators, despite that mistake in the last minute, still pull through yeah. and get the shutout against Flomp in game three. And they do it through physical fashion. I mean, the demos, like you said, at one point, it felt like there was almost everybody from Flomp gone off the field. We saw a little bit of response from them with the physical it, it, play, I almost, it almost felt like a rumble game. Uh, yeah. You get the power up that just lets you hit the ball really hard, yeah. demo people. <laughs> it seemed like all of Everybody just had that one. Just yeah. had that one. Yeah. I they mean, were just, they were running through them like a hot knife through butter. And, <laughs> and you compared them to the Knights, and that's something I wanted to bring up to you right now was, I mean, are we seeing more physical play because of the Knights and RLCS being that aggressive play style and maybe starting a new trend I, for a lot of these teams? I just think it's the evolution of, of game play. Yeah. Once players start to become so good at defense, one way to guarantee they don't get a touch on the ball is to just delete them yeah. from the field. And the way you do that is bumps and demos. It's yeah. about it's a it's it's it and it's a difficult thing to pull off. You saw Garrett G even tweet about it last week that going for bumps and demos doesn't it's not an easy yeah. thing to do. You have to you have to hit it. Yeah. Also, you're risking your positioning. So it's it's a high-risk maneuver, but in some situations you can mitigate that risk. Like if you know that a team has no boost, or if all three players are in net, or if you are you just made a play and you're the only one up, you have some opportunities to go for it. And yep. we're seeing more and more teams take the opportunity every single time. Yeah, and it's really about the timing and the positioning, you know, as the aggressor. Sometimes if you do go for the demo, like you said, it's hard to pull off because then you're so far up, you can't rotate back, and you left your teammates alone on defense. And we saw that happen to Flaunt Mersant. Yeah. They went for that that play where they had somebody go in for the demo, and it didn't connect, and then they had overextended. They didn't get scored on, but it's not a 100% move. You can't just press the demo button <laughs> and get the win. I mean, maybe they should add that in. That'd be a nice addition. That would be a horrible addition. <laughs> Please never apply to work at Epic or Planet. <laughs> Nachito. Gets that ball out. And this one, Noli, key hit there to deny backboard. So, and you can see Relating Wave oh. gets the demo on Godsmilla. <laughs> right as Godsmilla got the boost, and now a long clear. We're already seeing demos from both sides. Nachito yeah. getting a demo on Noli. I mean, back and forth. But right now, Discombobulators, they just start the trend of being physical and then have a great play to follow it up. And they're just running around the field. And here's a shot right now. So many chances. Lots of space for Discombobulators. And now a chance for Godsmilla. That oh. one 
saved by relating wave a huge save that one was gonna find the back of the net had he not gotten yeah. in the way and one thing i've noticed oh, another, love. <laughs> another devil the insurance premiums must be insane this season <laughs> i mean think of all the shots from flop are blazing fast and yet this combined with bobby Lairs, they get the save and the shots are so little literally frequent because there's just so many physical plays and demos you feel for flop virtuoso cutting out the play another attempt virtuoso staying in the play there with low boost and still got that clear good communication oh the touch gosh. off the backboard it's up for Nachito, puts it off the backboard again. Relating Wave in position, takes another oh. shot. This one off the backboard as well. Discombobulators, it's an all-out assault right now. Virtuoso a positioning for the challenge. It kicks back to Relating Wave. He's up, though, good speed. It's dropping back down to the middle. Nachito denied by Godsmilla. Nachito again, the shot towards net, and Noli hits it off to the side to throw, and the double demo. Oh. Godsmilla's the last Follow. back, looking for help. Ooh. He can't find it. It discombobulates. Get the first goal. The double demo into an insane angle. Look at related wave. That's a hard shot to pull off. Oh. I thought he was going to go for the pass, but he manages to get the angle. And right now, it's a, it's a train wreck for Flom. Love it or hate it. The <laughs> demo meta is here, and it's working. I mean, okay, single demo meta. That was meta. a beautiful That's shot great. as well. That was, yeah, a, a single player double double demo into that That's like a, a new meta in itself. That was Beautiful. That was absolutely beautiful. But then the dunk's gonna roll right back towards net. Flop tie it up. I mean, discombobulators, they got a little bit too confident here. Two players up right now for Flop, and Godzilla gets a perfect challenge just to feed it right into the goal. And that's an excellent way to stop the momentum from discombobulators who were just yeah. going nuts. But that and dunk right the there might cool response. them off. Yeah. And they might cool them off. I thought Virtuoso was going to go for another demo there, opting to hit the ball instead. A rare decision. <laughs> shot towards net, turned aside, bouncing out to the middle, though. Good shot. That one slotted upper 90. What a shot. He has been so consistent, though. The finisher right now for Flomp and just getting around the defender beautifully upper 90 placed. You can't get any better than that. Tho has been just so fundamental with shots. It's been surgical. A player that can just get the goals when you need them. That little floater there by Virtuoso opening up a shot opportunity for relating wave. But now the ball was cleared out. Virtuoso there. Nachi Tho, can he get to the ball in time? Yes, he can. The passing play from Discombobulators. Using that midfield space that Discombobulators have done so well and executed it perfectly. Nachito, even if the pass was a little bit forward, there was no defensive rotation from Flop to get any kind of interception. Discombobulators answering right back. This one gonna bounce hard and down and almost getting read by Nachito. Though jumping right in time, Nachito looking for that corner boost steal. Noli. The clear, a bump from Nachito in net. Virtuoso. Over to Godsmilla. Godsmilla, hard hit, but relating wave clears. Yeah. Nachito dodging the demo from Godsmilla as well. Center ball. Kicks back. Virtuoso off the ceiling, no boost. He's going to have nothing here. Nachito comes in to help him out. Virtuoso deciding to stay in the play. He'll be out for a while. Noli. Challenged by Relating Wave. Relating Wave, the flip reset to clear it even further downfield. That delayed the challenge from Godsmilla. And so much pressure from Discombobulators. Match point for them. So much on the line. Top two contenders right now for the league. Discombobulators and Flump. Yes, the this is a, it's a top four matchup. Yeah. Discombobulators already at the top of the ladder. This would just cement their spot even further. Now the shot saved. Noli hitting downfield. Another block from Noli. Virtuoso, clear attempt. Those waiting for it. Relating wave up. Clears down center. Noli's right there, hitting it back to the corner. Virtuoso down the sideline. Godsmilla 
up in the air. Nachito with some space. Passes over to Relating Wave. Relating Wave, the shot saved by Noli. Relating Wave hard off the sidewall. Though going for a double tap. Bounces out. Noli with some time, getting challenged. Out to Godsmilla. Godsmilla to the corner. Those there. Challenges it. Bounce down to Godsmilla. Godsmilla off the backboard. And now a big clear from Discombobulators. And the ball hits the ground. We've got overtime. The series on the line for Flaunt Rassant. They need to get this goal. Otherwise, Discombobulators will cement their spot at number one, at least for the time being. So, challenge there and a big clear from Noli down the center. Responded to Virtuoso off the backboard. Denied again by though. The defense from Flump. They've been tested this game as well as last. Everything getting thrown at them. The physical plays, the great shots, good passing. And yet they hold strong here. Got Smilla. Clear downfield. Now this one bouncing way back. Noli. Getting challenged, he has no boost, nothing in the corner. It's gonna have to get back to net, not even a small pad. Finally getting one. Tho comes in to help him. But it's right to Nachito, who bounces it down. Relating wave, going for the dunk here, can't get it. And a challenge sends it back to Godsmilla, up in the air, Tho's up as well. The pass, back down to Godsmilla. Godsmilla off the backboard, it's gonna bounce down off the arc, relating. Getting stopped, good pop, but relating wave hits it to the side, though with the boost steal and the mid boost steal as well. This one back out to the demo. Oh. Godsmilla looking for something there, going for the, the enemy, the, the goalkeeper, trying to get something, and he can't connect. And that demo could just open it up, we've seen it, but Discombobulators hasn't really been physical for yeah. a while. It, it was that instant response after the double demo. It just stopped everything. Now center ball. And oh, it looks like Tho got in the way. But Godsmilla wasn't even close enough to get to a center ball. Virtuoso low on boost. Picks up one pad. Floats it over one. But Tho's Noli. there. Over to Noli. Noli down to Godsmilla. And Godsmilla blocked by Relating Wave. Now Noli again, this one high off the crossbar. Nachito with a long clear. Got Smilla, last back, using up every ounce of boost to make that save. Gets the full boost now as Flomp prepare for the counterattack. This one popping out to Got Smilla, double commit. Also a team bump. Got Smilla going for the dunk. Does get a block, but it's down to Nachito who gets the hit and the boost. Nachito, because of that boost, able to make the follow-up play as well. Godsmilla off the corner. This one off the backboard, and Tho will deny it. Virtuoso, good speed. And another strong clear yeah. from Godsmilla. And the defense from that man, Godsmilla, has been on point throughout the, the rest of this game. Just always in position, getting every save he can. A good first touch. Tho... That light flick still making Relating Wave work for it. And now another double commit from Discombobulators. We've seen multiple double commits on defense and another double commit. No. It looks like the player was able to recover off the wall. So defense stabilizing for Dis Discombobulators as they start the attack. That little touch faking out Godsmilla. This one bouncing down and out. Nachito up. Hits it to the side, though has to back up for it. A little bit of awkward positioning. Oh, what a shot, shot to his net! That one off the post and out! Relating Wave leaves it for Nachito, who gets demoed. A close call for Flump. And what a shot from Relating Wave off the corner. And the pressure still stacking up for Discombobulators. So close. And yet it's still tied here in overtime. We just hit the four minute mark. Discombobulators trying to seal the deal. This one off the backboard. Follow. And Virtuoso was there, but though had gotten enough of it. Follow up from Relating Wave. That one just wide. Virtuoso back to the middle of Godsmilla will get the clear. Nachito passes to Relating Wave. Relating Wave down. Noli clear to the side. And another clear. Following up with a big dunk. 
Throws up, out of boost. And he'll have to bail out. Relating wave. It's his second shot. Off the post. So close. Discombobulators almost finding the back of the net. But not close enough. Virtuoso getting bumped. Got Smill off the corner going for a dunk, but Nachito will get it. Rolling down the sideline. No bo boost for Nachito, but he gets a huge challenge. Another one going to go for the no dribble, <laughs> no dribble, dribble, or no boost dribble play. Almost got pool shot into it. Making me stumble over my work. He was like trying to tee it up there. Pressure continuing to mount. We're past the five minute mark. A full game of Rocket League having been played in overtime at this point. Virtuoso going for the dunk. Can't get there in time. Relating wave and throw. Go head to head. It pops up to Noli off the middle. Noli off the backboard. Virtuoso misses. Though sends it off the backboard as well. Nachito and Godzilla gets a piece of it and Virtuoso knew Godzilla was gonna come in from that angle. It's cut off the play. As Noli goes for the backboard, Nachito hits it across net. Confident that no one from Flaunt Versant was there. Yeah. Relating wave down to the middle. Virtuoso getting dunked. Oh, that little touch that is it? bouncing in, it is! And at right at the six minute mark, Tho gets credit for this overtime and goal. Flump, I mean, they hang on by a thread. I have no idea how they managed to sneak away with this game. It was so close time and time again for discombobulators. And yet Flump, they managed to stay in and force a game five.